Imagine standing at the crossroads of your life where every direction promises a future, but only one leads to the realization of your dreams. The path isn't marked by signs, but by decisions shaped not by chance, but by action. What if I told you there exists a secret, a catalyst that could propel you towards your goals faster than you ever thought possible? Would you lean in? Listen and apply this knowledge to sprint ahead in life's marathon. Now think about the goals that, in your mind, when the world is quiet, these aspirations, big or small, personal or professional, form the blueprint of your future. But how often do we find ourselves running in place, our goals seemingly just as distant today as they were yesterday? It's a common human experience one that unites us in our quest for achievement and fulfillment. The secret to breaking this cycle, to achieving your goals faster, isn't found in a magic formula or a one-size-fits-all solution. It lies within a principle known to philosophers, artists, and achievers throughout history, yet often overlooked in our daily hustle. The secret is the profound power of personal development. Personal development is the foundation upon which you can build a life of extraordinary accomplishment and happiness. It's about becoming more, so you can achieve more. But what does it mean to engage in personal development? It means cultivating a mindset that seeks out growth, embraces challenges as opportunities for learning, and views failure not as a setback, but as a step forward. Consider this. Every goal, you wish to achieve is tethered to the person you are at this moment. To reach these goals, you don't just need to do different things. You fundamentally need to become a different person, more knowledgeable, more resilient, more skilled. This transformation doesn't happen overnight, nor does it occur by accident. It requires intention, effort, and a commitment to continuous learning. But where do you start? The journey of personal development begins with self-awareness, understanding your strengths and weaknesses, your passions and fears, lays the groundwork for meaningful change. From there, it's about setting targeted goals for your growth, whether that's improving your communication skills, learning a new language, or mastering a discipline. Engaging in personal development also means surrounding yourself with inspiration and knowledge. Read books that challenge your thinking, attend seminars that push your boundaries, and seek mentors who've walked the path you aspire to tread. Remember, you are the average of the five people you spend the most time with. Choose those who reflect the future you wish to create. Now, as we embark on this journey together, let's keep in mind that personal development is not a destination, but a process. It's an ongoing journey of self-discovery and growth. By committing to this path, you unlock the potential to achieve your goals faster, not through shortcuts, but through becoming a person capable of overcoming the hurdles that stand between you and your dreams. Have you ever paused to consider the immense power lying dormant within your own philosophy, the very framework of your thoughts and beliefs? It's the silent force that shapes every aspect of your life, from the decisions you make to the heights you aspire to reach. Philosophy isn't merely a subject to be studied. It's the essence of who we are and who we are. Your personal philosophy is the compass that guides you through the tumultuous seas of life. It's the lens through which you perceive challenges and opportunities, the judge that values your actions and choices. But have you ever wondered how this philosophy, this set of beliefs that you hold dear, could be the key to unlocking a faster path to your goals? Let's delve deeper into this idea. Consider for a moment the beliefs that form the bedrock of your daily actions. Do you believe that hard work is the sole architect of success? Or do you value the smart application of knowledge just as highly? Your answers to these questions are the building blocks of your philosophy. They dictate how you approach your goals, how you navigate obstacles, 
and how you measure your progress. Now think about the power of adjusting your sails in the midst of life storms. Just as a skilled sailor uses the wind to propel the ship forward, you can use the challenges and opportunities life presents to fuel your journey towards your goals. This is where the magic happens. By refining your philosophy, by ensuring it's aligned with the principles of growth, resilience, and continuous learning, you set the stage for accelerated success. The beauty of personal philosophy is that it's entirely yours to shape and mold. It's a living, breathing entity that evolves as you journey through life. But to harness its power, you must first become acutely aware of its current form. What beliefs are serving you well, propelling you forward, and which are holding you back, anchoring you to the shore of complacency? Once you've mapped out the terrain of your philosophy, the next step is to cultivate a mindset that seeks out growth in every experience. Life is a rich tapestry of lessons, each thread woven from the successes and failures we encounter. Embrace them all. Let each challenge refine your philosophy, making it more robust, more resilient. But how do you actively shape your philosophy? Begin by feeding your mind with ideas and knowledge that challenge you to think bigger, to dream bolder. Surround yourself with people who embody the qualities you aspire to. Their perspectives, their wisdom, their very approach to life can act as catalysts, transforming your philosophy into a powerful engine of success. Remember, the goal isn't to adopt someone else's philosophy wholesale, but to let the wisdom of others illuminate the path to crafting your own. It's about finding that unique blend of beliefs and values that resonate with who you are and who you wish to become. And as your philosophy evolves, so too will your approach to achieving your goals. You'll find yourself not just walking, but running towards your dreams. Fueled by a philosophy, that empowers you to seize opportunities, to learn from setbacks, and to embrace the journey of personal development with open arms. So let us not underestimate the power of our philosophy. It's the bedrock upon which we can build a life of extraordinary achievement and fulfillment. By consciously cultivating a philosophy that embraces growth, resilience, and the pursuit of excellence, we unlock the secret to achieving our goals faster. It's within this philosophy that our potential knows no bounds, where our dreams become our destiny. In the grand tapestry of life, where does the art of setting goals fit in? Imagine for a moment that each of us is a sculptor and our goals are the marble from which we carve out our masterpiece. How do we ensure that each strike of the chisel each decision and action moves us closer to unveiling the work of art we envision. The answer lies in mastering the art of goal setting. Consider this, what separates the dreamers from the doers, the wishers from the creators? It is the clarity and precision with which they set their goals. Setting a goal is not merely about stating a desire or a wish, it is about defining a destination so vividly that every step you take is imbued with purpose. Every effort is directed, and every setback is seen not as a deterrent, but as a detour on the path to success. But how do we set these clear, compelling goals? The journey begins with the vision of what you wish to achieve. This vision must be so clear in your mind that you can see it, touch it, feel it, before it even comes to pass. It is from this vision that you draw the blueprint of your goals. The process of setting goals then becomes an act of bringing your future into the present so that you can take action on it now. Writing down your goals is a crucial step in this process. There's a profound power in putting pen to paper, a magic in the act of transforming thoughts into tangible words. This isn't just about creating a reminder for yourself. It's about making a commitment signing a contract with your future self. It's a declaration that says, this is where I'm going and nothing will stop me. When you write down your goals, they cease to be just ideas floating in the ether. They become real, actionable objectives. 
But setting goals is not just about defining what you want to achieve. It's also about understanding why it matters to you. Each goal should be a stepping stone toward a larger vision, a piece of the puzzle that is your life's purpose. This sense of purpose fuels your motivation, lights a fire within you that keeps you moving forward, even when the road gets tough. Now, consider the power of visualizing your success. Visualization is not mere daydreaming. It's a deliberate practice that harnesses the power of your imagination to reinforce your commitment to your goals. When you visualize, you're not just seeing the outcome. You're feeling the emotions associated with that success, experiencing the fulfillment, the joy, and the pride. This emotional connection deepens your commitment and propels you forward with an irresistible force. But setting goals and visualizing success is just the beginning. The real magic happens in the pursuit of these goals. It's in the daily actions, the small steps taken consistently over time, that big dreams are realized. This is where discipline comes into play. Discipline is the bridge between wanting something and achieving it. It's the ability to keep pushing forward, to stay focused on your goals, even when distractions and temptations abound. Achieving your goals also requires flexibility. While your end destination may remain constant, the path to get there might need to adjust as circumstances change. Being rigid in your methods can lead to frustration and stagnation. Instead, embrace the journey with an open mind, ready to pivot and adapt as needed. This agility is a key component of successful goal pursuit. In setting goals, we also open ourselves to learning and growth. Each goal achieved is a lesson learned, a testament to our ability to overcome challenges and evolve. And with each goal that eludes us, we gain insights into our limitations, our fears, and our areas for improvement. The art of setting goals, therefore, is not just about achievement. It's about becoming a better, stronger, more capable version of ourselves. As we forge ahead in our journey of goal setting, let us remember that the true value lies not just in the achievement of the goal, but in the person we become in the process of pursuing it. The discipline, the resilience, the courage, and the wisdom we gain are the real rewards. These are the traits that will propel us toward our next goal, and the next creating a virtuous cycle of growth and achievement. So let us embrace the art of setting goals with the seriousness and reverence it deserves. Let's set our sights high, arm ourselves with a clear vision, a deep sense of purpose, and an unwavering commitment to our journey. For mastering the art of setting goals, to unlock the full potential of our lives, crafting a masterpiece that is not only seen in our achievements, but felt in the depth of our fulfillment and the breadth of our impact. Imagine, if you will, a world where the dreams you dare to dream always become the reality you live in. What bridges the expanse between those dreams and their realization? The answer, though simple, is often the most challenging to imbibe. This, it's the golden thread that weaves through the tapestry of success invisible yet invaluable. Have you ever pondered why discipline is so crucial in transforming aspirations into achievements? Discipline is the unwavering commitment to your path, even when the allure of momentary pleasures beckons you astray. It's the steadfast resolve to rise with the dawn, to do what is necessary, not just what is convenient. In the art of goal setting, if setting the goal is drawing the bow, then discipline is releasing the arrow, ensuring it flies true to its target. Let's delve deeper into the essence of discipline. It is at its core, a promise you make to yourself. This promise isn't bound by the conditions of the external world, but by your internal resolve. It's the silent pact that regardless of how fierce the storm rages outside, within the sanctuary of your purpose, you remain unshaken. Discipline asks of you not to be perfect, but to be consistent. Not to never fail, but to never give up. Consider the journey of any great achiever you admire. 
Was their path strewn only with roses? Or did they traverse fields of thorns? The answer you'll find time and again is that their success was not an accident of fate, but a testament to their discipline. They understood that discipline is the bridge between goals and accomplishment. Without it, the most beautifully set goals remain but distant, untouchable stars. But how, you might wonder, does one cultivate such discipline? It begins with the small, daily decisions. The decision to wake up early and dedicate the first hours of your day to your highest priorities. The decision to choose tasks that align with your goals over those that offer immediate gratification but no long-term benefit. Discipline means setting a schedule, not just for your work, but for your rest and play. Understanding that a well-rested mind and a joyful heart are just as crucial to your success. Yet discipline should not be mistaken for rigidity. It is, rather, the rhythm to which your life dances. It's understanding that there will be days when the music slows, when your steps falter, but the dance must go on. Discipline is what whispers to you in moments of doubt, encouraging you to take the next step, and then another, until you find your pace once more. Moreover, discipline is deeply personal. Your bridge to accomplishment will look different from anyone else's. It's crafted from your strengths, your weaknesses, your victories, and your lessons learned. This is why it's vital to celebrate your progress, to recognize the distance you've traveled because of your discipline. These moments of acknowledgement fuel your journey, reminding you of the power you possess to shape your destiny. Now, as we stand at the precipice of new goals and dreams, let's carry with us the understanding that discipline is more than a tool. It's a companion on our journey to greatness. It's the force that propels us forward when the path becomes steep and the nights long. With discipline, we transform the intangible into the tangible, the impossible. So let us embrace discipline, not as a burden, but as a liberator. Let it free us from the chains of procrastination, indecision, and complacency. Let's welcome it into our lives, into our daily routines, and watch as the doors to our dreams swing wide open inviting us to step through to the other side. In the unfolding saga of our lives, where moments cascade into years and dreams, weave through the fabric of our reality. Have you ever stood in quiet reflection and pondered the true essence of time? Time, that relentless force, marches on with impartial stride, touching the lives of dreamers and doers alike. Yet within its unyielding march lies a secret so potent that it holds the power to transform the ordinary into the extraordinary. The secret, dear friends, is not in bending time to our will, but in mastering the art of leveraging it. Imagine for a moment the symphony of your life, each day a note, each year a melody. How do we ensure that this symphony crescendos into a masterpiece worthy of our highest aspirations? The answer lies in understanding that time, in its infinite wisdom, is the canvas upon which we paint the mural of our lives. Every stroke, every color, every shadow is a testament to how we choose to spend our moments, hours and days. Leveraging time is not about racing against it. It's about harmonizing with it ensuring that each tick of the clock resonates with purpose and intention. It's recognizing that while we cannot control the flow of time, we can direct our sails to harness its winds. But how, you may ask, can we achieve such mastery over something as elusive as time? The secret to acceleration, to achieving our goals faster, begins with prioritization. In the garden of life, where tasks and responsibilities grow wild and unruly, prioritization is the shears with which we prune the unnecessary, allowing the essential to flourish. It is the discipline of distinguishing between what is urgent and what is important, between the tasks that fill our time and those that fulfill our purpose. Yet prioritization alone is but one half of the equation. The other, equally crucial, is focus. In an age where distractions abound, focus is the beacon that guides us through the fog of triviality. 
It's the unwavering gaze that turns obstacles into stepping stones and dreams into destinations. Focus is not merely about doing more in less time, but about doing more of what matters more. Consider the power of compound effort over time. Much like the ancient sculptor who frees the statue from the marble with thousands of deliberate strikes, our greatest achievements are often the sum of countless small efforts, repeated day in and day out. When we apply our efforts consistently over time, guided by prioritization and sharpened by focus, we create a force multiplier that propels us toward our goals with astonishing speed. But let us not forget in our quest to leverage time, the importance of reflection. Just as the wise sailor periodically checks his compass to ensure he remains on course, so too must we pause to reflect on our journey. Reflection allows us to savor our progress, learn from our missteps, and recalibrate our actions. It is in these moments of quiet introspection that we often discover the adjustments necessary to accelerate our journey. As we stand at the helm of our lives, let us embrace the timeless truth that time itself is a gift, a finite resource that once spent can never be reclaimed. Let us vow to invest this precious currency with wisdom and grace, leveraging it not just for the achievement of our goals, but for the enrichment of our souls. In closing, remember that the art of leveraging time is not a skill reserved for the few, but a discipline available to all. It requires not the brilliance of genius, but the resolve of commitment. As we continue on our journey, let us leverage time with purpose, prioritize with clarity, focus with intensity, and reflect with honesty. For in mastering these principles, we unlock the secret to not just achieving our goals faster, but to living a life of profound meaning and unparalleled fulfillment. In the grand tapestry of achievement, where each thread represents a choice, a chance, a challenge met. Have you ever considered the role of continuous learning and adaptation? It's a concept as ancient as time, yet as fresh as the dawn of each new day. The world around us evolves in the blink of an eye. Technologies advance, societies change, knowledge expands. In this ever-shifting landscape, the ability to learn continuously and adapt effectively becomes not just an asset, but a necessity for those who seek to thrive. Now ponder this, what is the hallmark of those who achieve greatness? Is it talent alone? Is it the serendipity of circumstance? Or is there something more, a deeper, more profound element at play? The answer lies in their unwavering commitment to growth to learning not just in formal settings, but in the rich classroom of life itself. They understand that the pursuit of knowledge is a journey without end, one that enriches not only the mind, but the soul. Imagine for a moment that life is a vast ocean, and we are sailors embarked on a voyage of discovery. The skills we acquire, the knowledge we accumulate, are like the sails we hoist to catch the winds of opportunity. But the seas are ever changing, and what carried us forward yesterday may not suffice tomorrow. This is where adaptation, the ability to adjust our sails to the shifting winds, becomes crucial. It's not merely about surviving the storms, but about learning how to dance with the waves, to see change not as a threat, but as an invitation to grow. Continuous learning is the compass that guides us through these uncharted waters. It encourages us to remain curious, to question, to explore. It challenges us to step beyond the comfort of the known into the potential of what could be. Every experience, every interaction becomes a lesson, a chance to add another tool to our arsenal, another skill to our repertoire. But how do we cultivate this mindset of continuous learning and adaptation? It begins with humility, the acknowledgement that no matter how much we know, there is always more to learn. It requires an openness to new ideas, a willingness to listen, to absorb, to apply. It demands resilience, the strength to face failure, not as a setback, but as a stepping stone on the path to mastery. 
considered the power of mentors and role models, those who have navigated the path before us. Their wisdom, their experiences, their failures, and their successes offer invaluable lessons that can illuminate our way, seeking their guidance. Learning from their journeys can accelerate our own growth, helping us avoid pitfalls and seize opportunities more swiftly. And let us not overlook the importance of reflection in the process of continuous learning. Reflection allows us to pause, to look back on our journey, to assess our progress and our missteps. It gives us the space to ask ourselves the hard questions. Are we moving in the direction of our dreams? Are we growing, evolving, becoming the person we aspire to be? Reflection is the mirror that shows us not only where we've been, but where we have the potential to go. As we stand at the precipice of the unknown, let us embrace continuous learning and adaptation as our most trusted allies. Let us commit to being students of life, learners in the classroom of experience, for it is through this commitment to growth, this willingness to adapt, that we unlock our true potential and step into the fullness of our power. In closing, remember that the journey of continuous learning is not a solitary one. It is a path we walk together, sharing our insights, our discoveries, our lessons learned. As we move forward, let us support each other, encourage each other, and inspire each other to reach for the heights of our aspirations. In the grand tapestry of life, where each thread weaves its own unique story, it's imperative to pause and ponder. What legacy are we crafting with our daily endeavors? Imagine, if you will, a world where each of us becomes a master artist of our destiny, painting not with colors, but with the bold strokes of our choices, our efforts, and our unwavering resolve. This vision isn't a mere flight of fancy, but a potential reality that beckons from just beyond the horizon of our current efforts. Consider for a moment the power of transformation that resides within the confines of your own will. The metamorphosis from a seed to a towering tree, from a caterpillar to a butterfly, is nature's testament to the potential that lies in change. And so, it is within us. The journey towards personal development, setting towering goals, and achieving financial independence isn't a path strewn with roses. It is a road paved with the grit of our resolve, the sweat of our brow, and the undying spirit of perseverance. Why then should we shy away from the embrace of change, from the embrace of growth? Why not seize the chisel and sculpt our own Michelangelo's David from the marble of our current selves? It is in this act of creation that we find our true purpose, our true calling, not just to survive, but to thrive, not just to exist, but to excel. The canvas of life awaits, and the paintbrush rests in your hand. What masterpiece will you create? The pursuit of excellence is not a journey embarked upon by the faint-hearted. It demands courage, it demands resilience, and above all, it demands a commitment to never settle for mediocrity. The road to greatness is littered with the remnants of half-hearted attempts and unfulfilled potential. Yet it is also illuminated by the stories of those who dared to dream, those who dared to strive, and those who, despite the overwhelming odds, dared to succeed. As we navigate the intricate dance of life, let us not forget that the music will stop one day. The question that remains is not if, but what rhythms will we have danced to? Will our steps have been tentative and unsure, or will they have been bold and confident? The legacy we leave behind, the imprint we make on the fabric of eternity, will be determined by the courage of our convictions and the strength of our actions. So I urge you, do not let this moment pass in to the annals of what could have been. Embrace the challenge, embrace the struggle, and embrace the unparalleled joy that comes from pursuing a life less ordinary. Let us not just be dreamers, but doers. Not just planners, but performers. Let us not merely wish for a better tomorrow, but take the reins of today in our hands and gallop towards a future so bright. It blinds the very stars. In the end, it is not the years in our life that count, 
but the life in our years. Let us fill every moment with a purpose, every day with a passion, and every breath with a hope. Let us live, not just for ourselves, but for the tapestry of lives we touch, leaving behind a legacy of excellence, a beacon of hope, and a trail of inspiration for generations to come.